I am definitely looking forward to, to playing in Boston. Uh, first two home games are sold out, uh, which is very exciting um, for myself. I don't think I've ever played in you know, a, a home game like that before. So definitely looking forward to the enthusiastic fans turning up, um, us putting on a good performance, playing some good football and hopefully coming away with a fair few wins. Boston has treated me very well. Um, you know, the sun's been out for a fair bit, and um, I got my way down to a, a Celtics game with my Aussie teammate Tamika Butt. So um, we're definitely enjoying, um, you know, the things that Boston has to offer, and um, you know, just loving um, the, the hot weather that that you you, you are providing for us. Uh, I think the um, Western New York Flash will be definitely a good one um, and a good one to, to watch. So that will be a tough one as well as a few other um, tough opponents. So definitely looking forward to um, you know this league and, and getting away with, with two wins already under our belt. Um, looking forward to playing more and more games with the girls and getting good results. I think it's a great team morale around. Um, you know, having Christine Lilly and um, Lisa Cole there um, in, in those coaching roles uh, has had a big impact on, on me and um, I'm looking forward to what they have to offer as coaches and, and they are um, you know, very high developed coaches um, as it is. So um, hopefully we can all put it together and, and you know, play some really good football in the park and um, like I said, um, come away with wins. Yeah, I definitely think that the Olympics will bring um, a lot more awareness to women's football in, in the country. I know, um, you know, it's huge as it is um, right now, but definitely with, um, you know, the success of, of, hopefully the success of the US women's team um, in the Olympics can definitely bring more attention to, to women's football in the country and, and definitely raise the attendance numbers um, week in, week out.